The nation's benchmark index closes below the 2,000 mark in the second day of the new year, reaching the lowest level in over two years. This comes as investor confidence waned due to concerns of a slowing global economy. According to South Korea's intel agency, a senior North Korean diplomat is seeking asylum in Italy. Cho Sung-gil, the charge the affairs of the regime's embassy in Rome and his family, are reportedly under the protection of the Italian government. A Chinese probe becomes the first spacecraft to land on the far side of the moon. Chang'e 4 is now ready to take detailed measurements of the moon's terrain and mineral composition.